All right, we got our first Sunday round of 2021-22 winter. So we're playing an awesome golf here today. Um, you can see we have a new setup here. We're kind of working on it to get the putting down and stuff. So uh, just a couple changes, but felt like playing. So figured we'd do one of these. And we're gonna play awesome golf. I love awesome golf anyway. So this is just driver trying to be down the right side, avoid the water. I was hoping to avoid the bunker, but I hit that pretty good. So that's a problem. Uh, now we've got to lay up. This 239 out of that bunker is not gonna happen. So we're gonna lay up with a five iron. Just try to get into position. Get that pretty decent. A couple things I like about Awesome Golf. One, um, it does put a premium on hitting the fairway. Um, you know, if you don't hit the fairway, you get a lot of penalty for all the distances and stuff. Um, two, I like that it kind of makes you have to really dial in on your approach game. If you're gonna make birdies, you gotta throw it in close, which is true. Most birdies are made when you hit the ball close. So I've got a 55 degree wedge here. It's actually the very first time I've ever hit it and so that's one of my goals for this winter. So I didn't try to hit that full. Um, one of my goals is to try and, um, you know, dial in yardages, things like that. You know, my, some of my goals for the off season are, I wanna swing it a little better where I, I'm hitting it farther. I need to hit it farther. I need to hit it a little bit tighter with my irons, so especially short irons. I need to putt better, which we're working on. So I need more distance, a little tighter with the, the, the irons. And my short game wasn't bad, but I just need to trust my short game more. So we're going here, three iron. I could hit three wood maybe, but if I don't hit it perfect, uh, or if I hit it perfect, I might go in the water. So I never like to hit a shot where I'm like afraid I'm gonna hit it perfect. So we'll just hit it there. I'm gonna hit a six iron. So I am using these Piper green balls, which are great. They're durable for a lot of hitting. So I do this with lessons and stuff, but they do go a little farther. They are a distance ball. So, I just, I'm gonna probably club up, or club down, I should say. That was a six from 188, uphill. That felt really good, hit it very well. Uh, you can see I carried it 190. I'm just getting more distance out of the ball. Now you could say, hey, why don't you do that for, you know, your game, you're trying to get more out of it. You know, the distance ball's fine in here, but when it comes to outside and all the short game and stuff, I'm going to want a little bit more control. So, same thing here, 170. I normally would try to hit a seven. I'm gonna hit an eight and see what we can get. I am hoping a little bit of this speed work, speed and fitness. I hope that's a little bit of why it's going farther, but I know the ball is a big deal too. That's just a little left. I hit it very good, but that's an eight. Hit very well, just left but I like the contact, I was hit very well. So, yeah, so that's what we're working on again too. I'd like to try to share with you some of my decisions, you know, and stuff like that. I'm always working on my own game, trying to get better, trying to know more, stuff like that. All right, let's see it, driver. Just trying to keep it a little bit on the right side. I like that one. So a big thing for me is I'm trying to draw the driver, but I, I'm, I've been hitting a lot of pull draws. So I'm trying to keep the face open. That one I liked a lot. Distance was about right. I, I feel like for what I've been doing, uh, I am trying to get that up a little more, but 
we will be working on that. All right, we got 137. So this is gonna be just a three quarter pitch. Normally be a full pitch. Hit it very good. Get in that circle. Bite right there. There we go, hit that one very good. Loving the irons, loving all the clubs from Sub 70. Got a new putter to go with it now. Um, you know, trying, trying to just get that part dialed in. I feel like I'm swinging good. I'm trying to just take away some of the excuses and uh, you know, then work on my swing, which is a big deal. Driver here, try to hug that right side. That's left. That's afraid of staying the fairway. Oh, that's afraid of the water a little bit there. So semi rough, it's a good lie. You know, it's just not gonna let me go. So big thing here is try to get to a number. I'm gonna try to hit it about 190, leave myself right around 80, which is a just a good uh, lob wedge. Trying to get to 80 in, which again, I don't think enough people do. That ball went a lot farther than I thought out of the semi rough though. I thought I, thought I was gonna hit it with a little bit of resistance. That ball just took off. That was a five iron, so uh, let's see. Still not bad though, 70. I like this yardage. It's just a nice, smoother, little uh, lob wedge. Oh, I hit it too far. Spin right there. Just too much, still hit it too deep. If you see 80, I hit it 79. I like that 80 number. Let's see, what do we got? 199, I'm going to hit a six, because five is probably going to, I normally hit a five, but again, distance ball. Making adjustments on the fly, seeing what's going on. We're gonna go six. Oh, that's left. Oh, that's gonna be deep too. Pull left. Not my best there. Let's see what we got. 24 from the rough. Try to hit maybe a 35, 30 yard shot because of the rough. Get there. All right, beautiful. So one of the things I'm trying to do too is pay attention on short game. I don't want to just hit chips. Um, I don't want to just hit chips because when I go out and play, I'm just finding it's a little bit of a challenge to, uh, you know, just take the chipping to the course. It's just, it's easier to chip inside. So, you know, you can hit it off the, the mat, stuff like that. And we're just trying to work on that a little bit. Driver here. Ooh, I like that one a lot. That one felt good. That felt good, yeah. I mean, that's kind of where I've been at the end of the season, 250, 260 carries. Um, you know, here, because there's water up there, I'm not gonna get there anyway. I'm going to lay it up. Same goal, try to have around 70 to 80 in, so. What I like to do a lot of times on layups is hit punch irons. Because I feel like I have more control. I hit that very good. I think it's gonna be too much. Maybe not. I was trying to go about 180 to 190. No, yeah, got the number. So I like to hit punches. You have more control on a punch. And now I hit 179 earlier. 
So we're going to try to dial that up. So just recall a little bit. See if we can pull it off, don't spin. Yep, there we go. Just work off of things you've done in the past. Here we go, par three, what do we got? Or sorry, par four. 427 dog leg, plenty of room out there for the big dog. Actually, the farther you go, it starts getting wider. So no reason not to hit driver here. Pretty good, maybe a little on the toe, so I'm not gonna get as much carry. Yeah, just a little down, but you get a little more run when you hit it on the toe. So, not bad, not bad. 159, looks like it's up. Again, it's just these distance balls playing a little farther. So I'm gonna hit a nine. Hit it good. Get down. Right there, sit. Oh, it's, oh, I missed it by an inch. So close. So again, I like the awesome golf. I like the feeling of, you know, if you're gonna make birdies, you gotta hit good irons. That's a, that's a true thing. And it's just fun. I mean, they have a good little thing and they have the best practice. I think I love their practice coaching setup. So we got f normally this is four, it's downhill. So we're going five. Just to go five. Hit it pretty good. Felt maybe a touch right, but I hit it very well. Breaks. Fringe. Now, this will be interesting because I find, let's see how it does. I have not tried a very short shot. And this is where it gets a little dicey, you know, on any sim. So 10, let's see. Yeah, this is where it gets a little tough. And let's see, I haven't tried these out in the new simulator yet. Hmm. We might not get to finish. Let's try one more time. So, a little awesome golf thing here. Now this is where I always wonder because awesome golf does not, so here's what I'm gonna try. I'm gonna tilt the unit down. because that's what you do in E6. Yeah, they, it, it likes the unit up. So, all right, we're gonna have something to figure out, but there's our first Sunday round. We didn't get to finish it. Where are we at right now? We're at two under, we were close. Um, I'm gonna work on this and we'll report it back. We'll give you some uh, feedback on how we're gonna fix it, but good to be back on the Sunday rounds. And uh, hey, it's not technology if it doesn't work all the time, you know? So anyway, we'll see you then in a future round. Make sure you click that subscribe button, all right? See you later, everybody.